Okay, welcome back everybody to The Medium. My name is Singularity and in the last episode we escaped from a demon. I assume it's a demon. It's the only thing I can imagine it's going to be. Uh, but we still haven't helped Sadness though or found Thomas. So we're going to... I hate the fucking flashlight thing now. Honestly, it is... There's someone there. There's someone down at the end though, isn't there? Marianne. Mary and... Okay. Sadness? Is that you? Are you okay? What was that thing? Hello? Fine! Richard! Richard? Richard! No, Sadness. The man I'm looking for is named Thomas. Who's Richard? Day room. Day room. Ah, oh, it's gonna be another creepy little kid in it. Are you trying to show me the way? I'm hearing some scratching as well. I don't. Which I'm just. I'm not okay with it. I got nothing. Fucking hell. So that's a win. So that's a window. So I need a key. Hotel register: Bruno Kowalski, Helena Smart, Victoria Mora, and Boris Zelazo. Great. I'm so honestly, I am so on edge. Like, so this flashlight does shit. Hold up, there's a map. There's a big map, wasn't there? Yo, this has got so creepy so quick. You are here. Uh, seven is the day room. So I need to go down and round. Oh, so sharp. I don't really want to go in the day room. I'm going to be honest with you. I got nothing. All right. What now? The day, the day room, the safe place. Say, this game's really, it, it's, it's built up, and I'm not okay. The safest place is for the youngest. Yeah, spooky. In any way, shape, form, whatever. If random shit opens before you, don't go through it. Family time. Holidays in the country. Oh, this is cute. I hate that little bit of random noise because it really fucks me. Ooh, this looks like First it. Thomas, then Richard. Before I knew it, I was looking for a bunch of strangers. At least Who's Sadness this? was still with me. Oh, it's collapsed. In a way. Oh, Sadness is with you, alright? Can I not just take a map of the area with me? It's quite dark. Can I up the brightness? Yes, that's what I want. Uh, no, I'll have to do... If it's too dark, I'll, I'll, I'll go back and just check to make sure everything's okay. But I don't want to ruin the ambiance. Oh, what's this? Is there an X? Is that... Oh god, it's everywhere. It's just red paint. How many people died here? No one, it's just red paint. It's all in your mind. He says looking... What is that? He says looking closer to the screen to make sure nothing's... Oh, hello, Mr. Demon Man. So the 
shiny over here? Oh no. No, no. Yo, this was a massive pull. Do I want to jump down just yet? I will, because I think there might be some stuff down here. Well, what's the point in looking? What was the point in that? Someone living here? Definitely heard some, I'm hearing some whispering. I think someone's living here. <clears throat> Get off the ladder. Coming from. I thought I saw a face at the window. Oh, Marianne, this isn't good. This really isn't good. Don't think my heart's gonna gonna enjoy this. Why? Well, what the fucking? What was the point? When I see nothing, I see a crawl space though. So you know, <laughs> preemptively dart away from the screen. A thing. I don't know if I want to hear this. Cover your nose. Try not to look at him. The sooner we're done, the sooner we can get out of this place. Ah. Uh, definitely didn't need to feel that. What do we think they were doing? Burning bodies. When they had no more use to them. Like a mass grave. We're going to find a mass grave. You'd think as well if, like, hundreds of people died here, that they would, um... My dearest, I wish this was it. The moment I pluck up the courage and actually send this one. It seems so easy. Just throw it in the mailbox. Then why can't I? Someday, I promise. I love you with all my heart. F. <clears throat> Who is F? <coughs> <coughs> Do we know who F is? Am I stupid? I don't know where we meant to go. Sadness? Can we... Can we meet your sister? Happiness yet? Yeah, please. Um, any goodies? Any goodies? Goodies? Okay. Good old Frank. Francis, what am I supposed to do with you? Once Neva shut down, you begged me to keep you on. Says you needed time to sort things. Said you could be useful. But now I know you're just using me as... Oh, fuck off with the thing. Now you're just using me as an excuse. Like those letters you keep writing. I know you you never sent a single goddamn one. Family's doing good, Mr. Reykjavik. I'll probably go home this go home this next spring. Summer at the latest. Who are you, who are you kidding, Frank? Hell, as long as you're here, I can at least keep an eye on you. Make sure you don't get hammered and pass out in a snowdrift. Guess it's the least I can do. Good old Frank. Too scared to live, too stubborn to die. Sometimes I feel guilty using you like this, but then I remember I need all the help I can get. Oh. So F isn't sending his letters. You know, I'm good. I'm good. I don't want to go down. Frank, I swear to God, I'll kick you square in the nuts if you jump out of me. Oh. Hey, Marianne. Hello. You look like shit. Yes. I'm really glad something didn't jump out there.
Are those bolt cutters? Uh, perhaps coat butters. Might be useful. If only I could reach them. Uh, all right. Then I need a thing. Oh, fucking sadness, you bitch. Whoa. Sadness? How did you... Ah, shit. Yeah, stop, sadness. Well, that's my seven years bad luck. Okay. What the fuck's that got? Oh, follow. Okay. <laughs> that don't sound like no sadness. I don't like all these bloody clothes. Guys, I'm fucking nervous, you know. What's the goddamn point? Let me be frank. This case is problematic. My superiors want it to go away. I want it to go away. You can see how your statement complicates that? Comrade. Comrade. I... Yes, I understand. Some things don't just go away. They stick. They echo. Uh, okay. Cool. The nurse. She did it. She killed them all. It was like something possessed her. Is that really what you want us to put on record? It's what I saw. The nurse. But how? Why? Just said they were possessed. Uh, so do I need to go back round and up? It made me jump back down, so... Oh no, I can't. Fucking idiot! God, sometimes I just... I'm so dumb. There's a proper rumbling now. This is still here. So how in the blue fuck? Right, no. I've done that, I've done that. I've done the one in the corner. Oh, stop freaking out, Marianne. I know, it's spooky scary. I feel it too. this way oh and then of course it's the other fucking way hey wait up come on slowpoke I've got an idea we're gonna show that weirdo what what are you gonna do hmm there were some kids here We've met one. Come on.
Okay, I'm going to leave it here for this episode. Um, I hope you enjoy, because it's definitely up the spookiness from... Even from the last episode, like, the demon was cool, he was wicked, he was scary. But, this is just more spooky because I don't know when shit's going to happen. But, if you enjoy the episode, please feel free to leave a like, drop a comment, hit subscribe. Tell me if you're enjoying the series so far or not. Um, tell me if, you, if you've watched any of my other stuff, please feel free to tell me if you enjoy it as well. If not, tell me why you'd enjoy it. Um, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Peace!